week, man. You're a Jersey boy, uh, born and raised. We talked last week. You said they play good football there. Um, but yeah, playing Rutgers this week, uh, hostile environment. Um, what do you think about your team going into this game, and how excited are you to get home, man? Uh, it's a very exciting experience. Um, anytime you get to go and play some familiar faces, that's a good thing. But um, as a team, we're just taking this as a great challenge, and we just can't wait. Good. Hey, we're, we're actually doing a little photo shoot at your high school. Your mom's going to be on our show, The Football <coughs> Fever. Um, are we going to see some uh, Eli Apple banners at your high school? What, what, what do we expect? Um, we're gonna there might be a couple of those, but um, nothing crazy, though. <laughs> nice, man. Hey, Gary on Conley's done a nice job opposite of you, but you're you're really the, the leader uh, when we talk about the defensive back position. What's it been like to kind of assume that role, and, and can you kind of describe your guys' relationship as well as just assess your play thus far? All right, um, you know, this is great to be that leader. Uh, this is a dream job for me, uh, you know, being a part of the Buckeyes and being able to have guys look up to me. So, I mean, me and Gary, we've really been working hard together. Like I said, uh, you know, we're always, you know, talking football. He's my roommate, so um, I mean, he's always been my roommate since I've been here. So we've always just, you know, talked football. We're really starting to grow together and uh, really become a great tandem, and that's something that we got to keep continuing. How heavily recruited were you by Rutgers? And how much did they want you to come there being a New Jersey kid and not letting you get out of state? Uh, I mean, it was, they weren't like one of the first guys or first schools to offer me or anything, but they really wanted me uh, after I came to their camp, you know, but uh, they they was always at my school. They used to always come and visit, pull me out of lunch and stuff like that. But, um, you know, there was a school, a school that I liked a lot and uh, that I was considering, but Ohio State was a you know better choice for me. So you, you got some, some acquaintances there, friends, guys that you played against or with? Something like that, yeah. Do what you, have, you, have you been talking this week or nah, no? Just me business, man. Radio <laughs> silence. <laughs> what have you seen out of number four, Leonte Carew? He's only played in four games this year. He's put up big numbers so far. Uh, Carew, he's definitely one of the um, you know most dynamic receivers in the country for sure. He's a uh, he's somebody with some uh, great skill set. I remember going against him last year. He was very physical. He was very fast, and uh, he's going to be a great challenge for our secondary. I can't wait for that matchup for sure. They're not sure if he.